At the end of this video, you know three unique ways to use a green screen. Let's get started. Hey everyone, it's Elliot from Filmora here to empower your inner video creator. If this is your first time here, don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell notification button so you don't miss the latest tips and tricks for video creation. Green screens are commonly used to change the background of a shot. If you are interested in learning the do's and don'ts to setting up, filming, and editing a green screen shot, we got a video for you right up there. But in this video, we're gonna try something a little different. I'm gonna show you three other creative green screen tricks. Ready? Let's go! Keying out a body part. Have you ever seen a movie where an actor has a body part missing? It's one part acting and another part green screen effect that made the performance believable. It's actually a really easy trick to recreate. Here's how. First, wrap some green screen fabric around the limb you want to key out. Make sure that the actor isn't wearing any green clothing or they'll be keyed out too. Next, make sure your camera is steady. Use a tripod or set it on a stable surface like a table. Now you frame your first shot. You want to start by filming the scene with your subject. Your second shot is called a plate shot. The exact same shot but without your subject or any movement. In editing, you are going to overlay your green screen footage on top of this shot. Without your plate shot, there will just be a weird void in your footage, so don't forget to shoot it. Shrink effect. Ever want to make a video where someone or something is really small? Well, you can, and all you need is a green screen. With this trick, you can shrink your subject and make their surrounding look bigger. First, you'll shoot your subject with a green screen background. Once you got that footage and the background footage you want, import them both into Filmora 9. On the video track, place the footage you want to look larger below the green screen footage. After that, it's time to get shrinking. In order to get a full body shot, we shot wider than we needed to for our green screen footage. We need to crop our footage so it only has the green screen portion in it. To do that, let's use an image mask effect, which you can find in the effects tab. With an image mask, we can select just the portion of our shot that works for keying. After that, let's use the green screen tool to key out the green and adjust appropriately. I still look a little too big. Let's make me smaller. To do that, double click on the green screen footage in the timeline and in the transformation menu, you can also scale it down. And that's it. Now I'm shrunken. Green screen shapes. This green screen trick will be sure to get your creative juices flowing. In this example, we'll be using sunglasses, but you could pretty much use anything. All you need to do is apply green to an object or creative shape and light it properly. Then, use the green screen feature in Filmora 9 to key it out. With this trick, you could create something like this. Or even this. Those are three easy, unique ways to use a green screen. Do you have an interesting way of using a green screen? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe for more video editing tips and tricks. Until the next one, keep creating.